ever wonder what it would be like to live on Mars? Well, now you could get that chance. Kind of, because NASA is looking for four volunteers to spend a year living and working inside a Mars simulator. So well, we got four people right here. Oh, well, I'm yeah. not going. Oh, you're putting it on? Let me put that out there right now. I'm not going to live um, in Mars. I'm not going to live in the simulator. Yeah. It's not happening. I'm not doing that. Um, also not going. Shayla, are you going on this extravaganza? No. Are you going? I am not going. Okay, no. so we got zero, oh, so we got more, zero people right here. It was all or nothing. It was, it like, was all or nothing. <laughs> oh, yeah. okay. So this simulator, I thought it's... I thought you would be the one. I thought you would be the one, too. <laughs> oh, no. It's a simulator <laughs> in great. Houston, Texas, where NASA has, has its facilities, some of its facilities. It's 1,700 square feet, so like this a, Mars like simulation. It's, it's a house. Okay. Everybody gets their own bedroom, though. Everyone gets their own bedroom. Okay. They get their own lounge area, medical station, and there are food growing stations too. Because oh. you're going to have to you got to grow your own food. you got to grow your own well, food. that'd be up your alley. You like food. Yeah, I love food. <laughs> so, sure. You like food? I don't actually <laughs> like space. Yeah. Food. You have to like space. Now, yeah. here's where it might not be up our alley. Okay. You do have to have uh you have to either be a pilot, yeah, okay. you right? Do. You mm -hmm. have to have doctoral work in oh, yeah. like math or biology. Well, we're out of that. So, oh, that's out. Right? Yeah, so, we're, we're all out of that. Now, it, it also feels to me like you'd have to be a very unique person to want to go for a full year yeah. in this house and never being able to leave. That like takes saying a lot goodbye of to your friends, yeah. to your family. <sighs> right? Uh, not only that, but then would you want to deal? So this is best case scenario, right? Well, NASA doesn't want best case scenario. They're going to throw everything out you. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. for example, you have to do routine spacewalks, even though I'm not sure how that would work, mm -hmm. a spacewalk if you're in a simulator. Mm -hmm. But then also, that includes equipment failures, so you got to worry about equipment failures, and you also have to worry about delays in communication. So you would not necessarily be speaking to people or even be a while until you actually hear something, just so that it would, it would simulate space travel, what really happens yeah. in space. So you have to be stressed out. Yes, all the they, time. Oh, can't wait to do that. that. Yeah. Great for an introvert. <laughs> yeah. 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 Like yeah, a, I can like see a that. smart then, introvert. But, but you'd have to be friends with the other three people. Yeah. Let me tell you, you something. That, things oh, can dissolve very yeah. quickly, too. Yeah. Friends yeah. can dissolve very quickly. So they get paid for this. So, yes, they can be, can be paid. You can be paid. It. I don't even know that I would do Big Brother. Right, okay. the show like that seems to me to be even too much, oh, and yeah. that's much yeah. shorter because than a year. They're observing you. I mean, they're they will yeah. be observing oh, yeah. how you do throughout this year. Huh. Yeah. Okay. I, I'm not even doing Big Brother like you said. Uh -uh. No. But they need to do this. Think about that. Like you are going to need to know what the psychological impact mm -hmm. is on a group of people if we're sending these people to Mars. Mm -hmm. For that amount of time, yeah. real world, real, Mars. real world. <laughs> yes, not he, not some weird house in Houston no. that's made out of so 3D weird. printer. Um, <laughs> if we're sending people to real world Mars, we have to know what it does to them psychologically. Yeah. I mean, that's why they look at all the astronauts that are yeah. in space for so long. Well, we so, know what it does to us, and we're not even there. We're not yeah. even there. <laughs> yeah. If you're like, looking to apply, wanna... the deadline is April 2nd. Okay. Yeah. A couple of things. you got to be a motivated U.S. citizen. That's what they said. Okay. Between the ages of 30 and 55, got to speak English. Uh, Non-smoker, and you mm -hmm. have to specialize. You have to have a degree in, what is it, engineering, math, or biology. Yeah. yeah. Well, well, they still have to yeah. go through the travel. You know, the travel time seems to be a lot easier. Yes. Because yeah. if you're going to Mars, the travel there is probably the worst part. Yes. That's going to take some time. Nonetheless, we're all here on Earth. Yes. Uh, 